Museums typically store more art than they exhibit. The Figi is no exception. Come with me where pieces in our newest exhibition, Dancing Towards Death, the Richard Harris Collection, are being taken from storage and prepared for installation. This collection belongs to Richard Harris and is on display through January at the Figgy Art Museum. The Dance of Death motif originated in the late Middle Ages and has been used to, as a form of social critique, criticizing the various social ills of society and the injustices. Here we have a, a from a book, The English Dance of Death by Rowlandson. Uh, here you have a figure of a skeleton painting a portrait of a very old, old, sort of decrepit man. And in the background you see a scene of, of, of a woman who is his wife and uh, with, a, with a much, much younger man pointing out the, the sort of the folly of, of this old man who tries to overcome his own death in some degree by marrying a much younger woman but instead falls victim to it. This is a 17th century ivory horn called an olifant and represents the noble Christian knight and he is passing by uh, the devil as well as the death. And the idea is that by leading a life of active life of virtue, one can achieve salvation and overcome death. Let's go upstairs to the third floor gallery where the art is being hung for display and take a closer look. Here we have a wonderful still life by Flemish painter Adrian van Utrecht. Not only do we have this beautiful uh, bounty, this display of wonderful objects, but there are also signs that, such, that all life is ephemeral and transient. Uh, we have the skull here that is the ultimate symbol of death, uh, the, and that is of course mirrored by the flowers here on the edge of the, you know, drooping over the edge of this table that are also dead, and so that really ties this is all in keeping with, with the theme of the exhibition on the dance of death. So the works that I selected illustrate sort of how this, this theme came into being and then uh, its various variations. So we have images that uh, well, its origins lie in the late Middle Ages and then it continues into the Renaissance and up into contemporary times. See Dancing Towards Death, the Richard Harris collection before it leaves in January.